Uh, just got done with practice actually, it went really well. We've been practicing for what feels like 10 years now, just waiting for our first competition to come up uh, in a couple weeks against A&M. So we'll kick it off this Friday with an inner squad scrimmage, just get the girls in a jersey and, and get them rehearsing what it feels like to compete in a match and what that routine is gonna be like. Um, and then open up with A&M at home on the 22nd and 23rd. So really tough uh, SEC schedule this fall. We draw the third, fourth, and fifth ranked teams in the conference um, starting right away in the fall. So we have quite a challenge ahead of us. Um, but the girls have been training really, really hard since January, since I got here. Um, and, and they're looking like they're ready to compete. So really high hopes for the fall. And, and then of course, the, the rest of the SEC schedule that we will finish up in the spring. Um, yeah, not much of an update. Haven't really started competing yet, but training hard always. Any questions for Coach Banworth? Okay. Oh, we have one from Jake Thompson. Just kind of coach, uh, you kind of talked about it and you're kind of in the same boat as coach Kiffin first year coach and then a pandemic hits and it kind of limits interaction and how y'all handled your summer. And then most of your fall until you found out what was happening. I mean, what's this been like for you just in, in trying to navigate learning your team for the first time? It's definitely been challenging. It's, it's felt a little bit like a roller coaster um, in terms of our training period, you know, we'll get sent into 20 hours and then back off into eight hours and then back into 20 hours. It's just kind of been, a little bit all over the place. So me and my staff, as, as well as the girls, have had to learn how to be really adaptable and, and, and figure out how do we get better in a really, really weird situation. So it hasn't been easy for us or for the team, um, but the big focus has been on learning and, and getting better every day. And I think that the team has really, really embraced that mindset, which has been awesome.